Hi! We have another tasting video this week because I don't know if you noticed but I spent the last five days <laughs> in Switzerland and it was absolutely freaking amazing. Lynn was born in Switzerland <laughs> and she was my wonderful travel companion. It was really really so much fun. So I asked Lynn to help me with picking some Swiss candy or just snacks because we have savory snacks, yay! And uh, to taste them with me. Let's start with something quite sweet. Yeah. Oh, uh, by the way, disclaimer, it's 8 a.m. in the morning. We <laughs> didn't have breakfast yet, though it's even 7.45. We hiked to see uh, sunrise. And the breakfast is not open yet, so we're just eating Swedish. Swedish, wow, why, why Swedish? Swiss. Swiss <laughs> snacks for breakfast. Because <laughs> that's what you do in Switzerland. You eat chocolate for breakfast. You eat chocolate all day long. Yes, exactly. Mm. So, something sweet. Which one? Uh, this one. The that's, Torino. That's the sweetest of all. Yes, with the Swiss flag. So it's a long chocolate stick. And I don't know. Don't tell me what it's filled with. No. <laughs> Ooh, cream. Mm. Mm. This is my jam. Yeah. This is so good. Mm. Mm. It's hazelnut cream, really good chocolate. Uber sweet. Really, really sweet. Mm -hmm. Really, really tasty. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good choice. <laughs> this is, by the way, really good in a little white bread. What? Kid, kids make that at school. No they way. They take a little white bread and they put the chocolate bar inside the bread. Like a roll? Mm -hmm. Bread roll? And then you can eat it like that. Like uh, you make your own chocolate <laughs> bread. Oh my god. <laughs> That's brilliant. You could also melt it in the bun. Mm -hmm. Mm. Okay. I've been dying to try this one. Okay, come on. Ever since it. we arrived in Switzerland, like I saw this and I was like, wow, that looks so good. It is called Aracusa. And it also has Swedish... Uh, sw why? What? Swiss! Swiss. <laughs> Damn it, Swiss! If you like Torino, you like Ragusa, I think. It's but very similar, but for the ones who love hazelnut, ooh, there's a big it looks hazelnut so schmancy, inside. looks man. It looks so schmancy. Wow. Oh, this looks good. Good. So it's like a layer of chocolate, two layers of chocolate, and in between there's, I'm guessing again, a hazelnut cream. Wow, this looks so good. <laughs> yep. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. I really like the whole hazelnut. Mm -hmm. That's extremely good. Mm. Cannot chop with, uh, stop with that chocolate. Mm -mm. This is very addictive. I would give it a um, I would give it a 9 yeah. out of 10. Sounds so good. good. Ooh, ooh. Cool. So if you like the more fresh, maybe chocolate for in summer when it's really hot and you still want to eat chocolate because you want to eat chocolate every day. Yes. There you go. Thank you. Here, that's for you. Oh, it's very crispy. It's creamy mm -hmm. inside, yogurt. It looks so pretty, yeah. Mm -hmm. With pink dots or something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like that. It's so fresh indeed. Mm-hmm. Mm. I like this a lot. Mm-hmm. Wow. I would give it a nine too. Yep. Also because I like the pink packaging. So cute. Look at this box. Mm-mm. -mm. And for once, it actually looks like the chocolate on the packaging. Well, actually the Rakusha does too. Nice. Let's continue with something savory. Because you some of you guys like savory and you like savory more too, right? Yeah, I prefer. So these are little kind of crisps, kangaroos, Jumpies. and that's a typical thing that we used to have when we were going for a picnic with school, a oh. hike, and we picnic, so everyone had this little bread, and these kind of crisps were really popular. Yeah. Because in Switzerland you hike with your school, you know? Yeah. In the Netherlands we go on camp, we go camping in <laughs> some kind of park. And we... Oh, this is so cute! Mm. They're actual little kangaroos! Mm. I'm gonna mm. eat it all. Mm. Mm. It's so crispy and light. Yeah. Wow. I'm not, I'm more of a sweet person instead of a savory, but this is really good. Yeah, I love them. Mm. They're so good. This is extremely addictive. Wow. Yeah, this is really addictive. And they're so small that you can take two or three at once and you mm -hmm. cannot stop. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I would also give it an eye. It's good. Like, I really, really like it. Mm, because I love um, salty, I will give it a 10. 
Nice. We're gonna save your favorite chocolate for last. <laughs> and have a surprise. Mm. But this one also looks really good. So it's the Frey Supreme Creme Catalana. So Creme Brulee. No, you shouldn't say that, right? It's not the same thing. Creme Catalana and Creme Brulee. Is um, it? there is a difference, but mm. I'm not. We don't know. Comment down below what is what is the difference between Creme Catalana and Creme Brulee because it looks the same. Anyway, it's white chocolate with Creme Catalana. Bam! And you haven't tried this one before either, right? No. Awesome. <laughs> and Frey is a, a Swiss brand, right? Yes. I wanted to say Swedish again, but I stuffed myself one time. <laughs> mm. I don't really taste anything except mm -mm. white chocolate. Mm. Me neither. And because of our Swiss chocolate adventures, I actually don't like white chocolate that no. much anymore. Me neither. It's so flavorless. Yeah. It tastes like milk and butter. Mm hmm And sugar. Mm hmm No. This uh, tastes like some Easter bunny chocolate. Just yeah. flavorless. <laughs> no. I, what kind of grade would you give it? Four? Yeah, me too. Maybe? <laughs> yeah, because it's like the, the taste is not that good and the, the creme catalana. Actually, I would give it a three. Okay, like honestly, a three. <laughs> if, you, if you make the packaging look this delicious, you better keep your promise, man. Can't yeah. do that. Can't disappoint us like this. No. So another savory snack, we have Gruyere. No, you say it. <laughs> <laughs> so, I haven't tried that snack yet, but um, I'm a big Gruyere eater, because that is um, one of the best Swiss cheese, it's very salty, so I'm really curious to see how it's on a snack. And it's like crackers. Okay. I tried that. I think I took two as well. <laughs> Do you feel the cheese on it? It's in the end. Mm. It's the aftertaste. So in the beginning, it's just like a regular cracker. Mm -hmm. Okay, you feel the taste, but I couldn't tell it's Gruyere. This That's what I wanted to ask you because this tastes like normal cheese. Yeah, yeah, nothing this is special. Really, no, it's it's really good. It's it's salty, so it's good. No, <laughs> but uh, you don't taste the difference of another cheese. Let's say cheese no. crisp or no. Again with the promises. Not good. Damn. It is a nice mm. cheese snack though. But I'm actually quite hungry from the hiking, so... <laughs> yeah, we just came back from the hike. We're waiting for our breakfast to start. Mm. <laughs> what kind of grade would you give it? Mm, more than the white chocolate. For sure. Maybe a six? I think so too, because it's a decent cheese snack. Uh, they're just not keeping their crier promise. Yeah. Promise. Kind of, kind of keep those promises, man. If you put it on the packaging, we need to taste it. Yeah. Your favorite. So, the best for the end. Wow! Yes. <laughs> I've never had this chocolate or even heard about it before Lynn told me. She said, like, <laughs> if you're going to try one thing that's Swiss and candy snack-wise, you need to try the Ovo Maltine chocolate. So, that's what we're going to... You know what I really like? That you have your Swiss la uh, flag on the... Yeah. <laughs> chocolate and um, is it on this one as well no but it's 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 a wonderful flag i love the flag the, flag. <laughs> the good thing with ovo maltine if you like it you still have the mm. how you say you that? have everything ovo maltine yeah you have many different products ovo maltine because ovo maltine is actually like a hot chocolate mix yeah thing, exactly right? it's originally like next week hot chocolate for sporty people yeah and it's really popular so they make many things out of it yeah and you even have the chocolate cream that you can put like nutella on your bread which is very crunchy mm, but this also looks quite crunchy it is Ooh. So looking forward. okay let's try it mm, yes mm. yes yes i understand mm. oh this is so good i love it yes it's the crunch man it's the crunch mm -hmm. oh i love the crunch the texture is so good. Mm -hmm. Wow, really, really good. Mm. How um, much would you give him as a chocolate lover? A nine. Very good. I agree. It's it's really really good chocolate. You need to try it. Mm. I think the ten for chocolate for yeah. these days definitely at the Max Chocolatier. We did a chocolate tasting with a master chocolatier. After you've tasted that chocolate, there's there's no supermarket chocolate that will, you know, top that. Yeah. So, that's why the nine. Exactly. 
Thank you so much, Lynn. Thank for you. Me pick the Swiss snacks and uh, telling us something about it. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, put a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also, Lynn just <laughs> just made an Instagram <laughs> travel link. So all go follow Lynn. You need to post pictures though. Okay. <laughs> I have one follower. I'm so famous, and this is my no follower. no no. <laughs> You need to follow it because she's so cute. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye! Bye.